Why did it sound like that? Dude, what the <laughs> How's it going, man? <laughs> oh, what is going on, bro? Going, you just bro? blew my mind, dude. I don't remember it sounding like that. It's a whole different car now, man. Damn. Oh, man. It's uh, just park in front of the second bay right here. I know you guys have been missing the NSX and Sean has done a lot of different things to this car recently. So, I figured today we'd give you a full NSX update. Flex on us real fast, Sean. Ready? The magic controller. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you touched so much. <laughs> oh, just, dude. Is that crazy? <laughs> what the? Also, Sean found an NSX friend on the way over here. This guy came by as well. Super clean, dude. Before we pull the car in, I have to actually finish the video, but this is Sean's first time at the garage, so give him a little tour real fast. Welcome in. Nice to meet you, Jay. He's a second in sex. <laughs> oh. And here is the shop. Yeah. What a beast. <laughs> All right, we got some of the cars moved out of the shop. Sean, are you ready to pull this bad boy in? Yeah, buddy. We're do a full little overview thing. This thing has changed so much since the last, what was the last time that they saw it on, on the channel? Was it the raise you guys, meet? Yeah, you guys seen it at the raise meet at that time. I, I still had the TEs on it. It's a completely but, different car. Yeah, now it's all, I will go through it all yes. in a minute. It has been a very long time since you guys have seen the WRX and the NSX together. Finally pulled them out. We gotta go yeah. cruise soon. It looks good together, dude. Yes. Throwback. It looks so sick from the front, dude. My favorite part, man. Not only did he change the complete exterior of this car, the exhaust is now insane. <laughs> it's loud and it sounds amazing. The car airs out so fast. Damn. It looks good in the shop lighting. Yeah, I love how it looks like under the lights, you know? If you guys are new to the channel, Sean used to be on the channel all the time, but yeah. work happens, stuff happens, we're still best still friends. Here, He's still here, but uh, Sean has completely changed his NSX. So last time you guys saw it, it was pretty much like yeah. stock when it came So right? last time you guys saw it, I pretty much just had like a front lip, side skirts, and maybe like a rear valance on, had the T's, like the stance look, you know, the stretch tire, but this time I redesigned the whole thing. The whole car got painted. Ooh, so obviously, yeah. dude, it so good. <laughs> yeah, so now it's, it has a little more purple to it. So last time you guys seen it, it was it had a little more blue, so it's still midnight purple, but times four added pearl on top. Yes. It's been a while. I figured for the channel, for everybody that's always wondering, because you guys ask me about Sean all the time, we give a little NSX update periodically when he gets new stuff. And I think we may even be doing some cool mods here. Yeah, but, man. Sean, let's do a full walk around of the NSX. So we went over the paint. The paint is brand new. Added some pearl, made it a little bit brighter purple. Even looks dark on camera. But uh, let's do like the body kit. What's the body kit? Yeah, so if you guys know about NSX, this kit right here is a spoon kit. So the front bumper is actually made for a 2002 NSX, which is is the fixed headlight type of NSX, which is like the newer generation, right? So what I did was I had this bumper and got it molded to my pop-ups. Shout out to SOS Customs, those guys killed yeah. it. This is their work right here. SOS Customs is also the guys that painted the wing on the GTR, so they do incredible work. This bumper is now one of one. Yeah, in the United States that okay. I know of, I'm probably the only guy who did this, but. So the bumper was originally made for the fixed headlight look. That's so cool, dude. So what SOS Customs actually did is completely completely cut all of this and molded it to fit his pop-ups. So that's pretty awesome and unique. So you guys seen it, it was on air before, but now I really need the air to protect this front bumper. Yes. Um, so another thing that they did, I have this Type R hood, which is carbon fiber, but they kept the inside of the vent carbon fiber. Just like and the painted accents. the rest. Yeah, like the little accents. You guys know I love little carbon fiber accents, like on the Evo and stuff like that. So Sean did that on his hood as well. So dope. These side skirts, these are different. These are Stacy side skirts by Downforce. And also to complement the whole spoon kit and look, I got the spoon mirrors, which you guys seen before. 
one of my favorites. Damn. And then we're gonna go to the rear here. This is the spoon rear bumper. Super aggressive, it gives it that long car look. I know all of the Honda guys that watch the videos are really gonna appreciate the whole spoon kit because that's like Honda's thing. Like yeah. Nissan has Nismo, Toyota has TRD, Honda has like Mugen and Spoon, yeah. so. Super iconic kit, yes. I had to do it. To go along with this rear bumper, I got the Pride V2 exhaust. Oh. You can like see it through the valence and everything. That's my favorite part, I think. Let's see if they can see it on camera. Oh, that's so sick. Pull the titanium tips too. Oh, I love how you can like see like the turns and stuff in there. That's just good. I'm thinking that we'll do some startup and revs and flybys when we're done going over the entire car later because this thing sounds really, really good. Next up, a little carbon fiber wing. So this is just the uh, Type R wing, right? We painted the center of it purple and then cut the sides carbon. Just the, like little accents here and there to add to it. So good, dude. Dude, <laughs> this blows my mind. It looks so crazy in here. Yeah, so this is just the uh, Foundry four-point strut bar added with the uh, downforce stack intake system that I have going on. Love that piece right Damn. here. Well, I have a bunch more stuff coming in. Whenever I get it in, Dustin will take a look and you guys can get a little more update on it. But yeah, this is just good. for now. The whole car ties in so perfectly, like the midnight purple, the carbon fiber, the titanium, it's Thanks, so bro. crazy. So to go along with the theme, I got the Spoon Gen 3 steering wheel right there. And then I just still have my Recaros. I have the other one to match, so now I have two Recaro SPGs. And if you don't know, these are the most tight fitting seats <laughs> you can possibly get. And Sean's a fucking big dude, ass dude. I make it work. Look at these fucking, <laughs> these guns, baby. Yeah, yeah, these are some sick seats. Spoon steering wheel with the titanium hardware too, by the yeah, way. The accents. Accents make it. Yep. Let's do the wheel. Oh yeah, so one of my favorite things I recently did was the wheels. These are Desmond Regamaster Marquis Pramadas in white. I don't know what he just said. That hurts me. It hurts me because I love to ease, but these look so good on the car. Now these are pretty rare too, right? Yeah, these are these wheels are pretty hard to get. Not just that they're hard to get, but like the specs that they come out with makes it rare. Yeah. Right? So the front is 17 by 8 plus 35 and the rear, those ones are the harder pair to get, which is 18, 9 and a half plus 18. And then of course, these wheels, I had to get them wrapped in Yokohama. Shout out to Yokohama, baby. Yeah. The NSX has got a full makeover. If you guys want to follow the build of this NSX, you can check out Sean on Instagram. His link will be on the screen. One important thing that we didn't show you guys is how the exhaust sounds. Yes. I think we need to go give this thing a rip. We haven't, we haven't, we haven't ridden this car in a very long time. Yes. Let's yes, do it. Very Let's do it. Let's go. Doesn't it sound so it crazy? It sounds crazy. I've, this is such a unique sounding car. <laughs> yeah, the NSX is always known to have like that crazy, like higher pitch, different tone, you know? Are you gonna send it right now, Sean? Are you gonna rev it? I'm gonna me? send it, bro. You ready? You guys yeah. know exhaust mods are my absolute favorite, especially on a car like this with that unique sound. I'm stoked to hear what this exhaust sounds like. All right, Sean, rip it for the board. <laughs> Oh, we should probably drive up a little bit. Yeah, let's go. Dude, that was so loud. That sounds amazing. So good, dude. Thanks, nope. man. Gotta get some good flyby shots. It's so loud, dude. This is not okay. We're gonna get in trouble. That was a full send. That was amazing. Sorry, sorry. So, so good. Oh, that's just, that's a good car. 
Let's go. Bro. How does it sound? Yeah. It sounds amazing. Yeah, before Sean leaves, he has to sit in the other JDM car. How does this compare to your seat? This is snug too, because yeah. the bolster like sits a little Super higher, bolster. but this is comfy. Nachi. Oh yeah, yeah, this feels really like, Dude. solid. What did you replace it with again? The Nismo short shifter. Oh yeah, nice work. Just a That's couple cool. JDM cars here. We're gonna cruise these soon for sure. Sean, dude, so it's pleasure, I'm so happy bro. for you. This car has come such a long way and it sounds amazing, looks amazing. That's dope. But of course, Sean stopped by and we had to give you guys a little NSX update. You guys have missed this car a lot. Sean's gotta go now because he has a girlfriend. Oh my God. We were on the hunt. We were on the hunt that was a while ago. That was hey, thank you for stopping by, course, dude. Bro. Always awesome. So you guys remember how I said that we were doing the clutch for the BRZ in order to go drifting this Sunday? Well, I also need some drift spares and I have a couple of you guys, some viewers coming and bringing me some spares. And I think he's, uh, I think he's here. What's up guys? Nice to meet you, man. How's it going, bro? Hey, thank you guys for bringing the tires. Seriously, dude. Hey, this thing's tight, dude. Nice, yes, perfect. Just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> Yeah, you too. See you guys. Ooh, got some fresh drift spares here. Thank you, Marco. No problem, man. You guys are the best. So actually, I decided I probably should leave these tires on there just so just so I have some, some actual good tires to use when I drive this car back home because I am going to drive this to and from the track. So I'll just load these up in either my car or TJ's truck and keep these to drive back home in. So BRZ is pretty much ready. I mean, it's tuned, got the new clutch, should be pretty good to go. So we're all good there with the new tires and everything. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I really enjoyed having Sean come by the shop for the first time ever. You guys will see a little bit more of him. He does have some more mods to do and he's going to come hang out. So hope you guys enjoyed the little update on Sean's NSX. If you haven't already, please subscribe and like the video because it does help out my channel a lot. Once again, thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video. Peace out.